What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management channel. My name is Andrei and today I'm gonna be doing an update on NEO stock. And before we get into all of that, if you guys would like to earn two free stocks with Vibble valued up to $1850, please check out that link in the description below. All you have to do is sign up for an account, deposit $100 and choose your free stocks. That's it. Let's start with a brief summary of this company. NIO is a holding company which engages in the design, manufacture and sale of electric vehicles, uh, driving innovations in the next generation technologies in connectivity, autonomous driving and artificial intelligence. The company provides users with home charging and power express valid service and other power solutions including access to public charging, access to power mobile charging trucks and battery swapping. It also offers uh, other value-added services such as uh, service package, battery payment arrangement and uh, vehicle financing and license plate registration. So, let's continue with the numbers and for now its total market cap uh, is uh, $54.82 billion. They have a revenue of $3.49 billion with a negative net income of $1.34 billion. They have very, very good uh, revenue growth of 202.26%. Uh, and uh, their total cash uh, for now is $7.21 billion with a total debt of $2.32 billion. Their current ratio is uh, very good and for now it is 3.06. And from the financial standpoint this company is uh, very stable. So and let's continue with some uh, latest news. We are on Yahoo Finance uh, and uh, this article was published on May 18th. And it's titled Positive Catalysts Revving Up uh, for Neo Stock. And uh, let me quote you some paragraphs uh, because uh, this article is the summary of upside potential of new stock. And let me start from this paragraph. According to Deloitte, the global electric vehicle industry is likely to grow at compound annual growth rate of 29% over the next decade. Considering the growth outlook, investors might consider exposure to electric vehicle stocks on intermediate corrections. So, this number is very meaningful for all the electric uh, vehicles manufacturers because uh, in next decade this market will grow with the highest velocity. And uh, over the next decade China is likely to maintain a leadership position in the electric vehicle market. After China, Europe is expected to be the next largest growth market. And uh, this news is very good for new stock because right here we are on CN EV Post and this article was published on May 13th. Neo tops China's all electric SUV market in April with 23% share. And uh, the number is mind blowing. Neo was the top selling brand uh, in Chinese uh, all electric SUV market in April with 23% market share, higher than Tesla 17%, WM Motor and Expand Motors uh, 7%, according to China Automotive Technology and Research Center data. And here we have uh, the diagram. Unfortunately, it is on Chinese, but nevertheless, we can see 23% uh, share of uh, new company, 17 for Tesla. And other companies, they don't have uh, so much exposure on the market, but they are still potential competitors for this uh, company. And let's continue with this uh, article. On top of uh, their leadership in uh, China, we can see that uh, Initially, the company will be launching its vehicles in Norway. This does not come as a surprise as more than 50% of cars sold in Norway last year were electric cars. NIO also has plans for expansion in the United States. That's unlikely to begin this year, but the key point uh, is that expansion into new markets will ensure that the vehicle's uh, deliveries uh, remain robust. The company is already building a new plant uh, in the Xingqiao Industrial Park in Haifei. This will cater to the incremental demand from China as well as from international expansion. From a financial perspective, NIO reported a vehicle margin of 21.2% for Q1 2021 as uh, compared to a negative vehicle margin of 7.4% in Q1 2020. Even on a quarter-on-quarter -quarter basis, the company's vehicle margin expanded. With the increasing vehicle deliveries, vehicle margin will likely continue to improve. And as you can see, NIO not only has a very good sentiment on the market in general, but also they consistently improving their financials and they consistently improving their internal processes. That's why this company is a very good candidate to add to your investment portfolio. 
And uh, one more competitive advantage that NEO has. And let me quote you this. From the perspective of uh, sustained growth in vehicle deliveries, NEO's battery as a service is a key reason to be bullish. The biggest advantage of uh, BAS is uh, that it significantly reduces upfront payments for buying an electric car. That price advantage gives NEO an edge over its peers. Further, with a monthly subscription fee, customers can avail themselves of battery swapping services or upgrades. And uh, basically all this information leads us uh, to their institutional investors. And right here we can see that uh, we have uh, different filings, uh, some of them are in red. And uh, these two companies, for example, they closed their position. But these two companies combined closed the position for only $250,000 in value. It's not so big. On top of that, you can see that the majority of companies uh, hold their position or slightly increase their position in NEO. And that's why, in my opinion, overall, we are very bullish on this uh, stock. And let me show you this information. We are on Vanguard.com and uh, we are on section about NEO. Right here we can see analyst ratings. And we have uh, 13 analysts of uh, Vanguard who suggest to buy this stock, 6 analysts who suggest to hold it and only one who suggests to sell. And that's why I think uh, it is a very good uh, company to put your money in. So, and before we dive deep uh, into the technical analysis, please subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. I made my previous video somewhere at this point and we have this price action since I made my previous video and the last time I've told you that we might hit uh, this uh, accumulation point. It is the level between 0.618 and 0.65 from the bottom to the top because uh, we, have we have finished uh, all the five waves. And these five waves, it is only one wave on a greater scale. This means we are on a retracement phase on a wave two. And uh, for now, it is one of the best accumulation points to add your position with this company. And let me show you more thoroughly. Right here, we have this price action. And uh, you have to remember that uh, the last wave on, of the retracement have to have a five wave structure. And let me show you more thoroughly. On one hour time frame, we have uh, this wave and let me show you my breakdown. From this top, we have this is our first wave, this is our second, this is our bottom of the third one, this is the fourth retracement and we have double bottom right here, as you can see. And uh, this pattern is very, very bullish. We have almost uh, the same level with this previous uh, bottom. This means this level is a very strong support level. And uh, from this point, I have about 70% uh, certainty that we might go up. And that's why the levels below $35 is the best point to accumulate your position with this uh, company. So what to expect next? In my opinion, we have uh, not more than 15% probability to hit uh, this uh, level, this accumulation point. And uh, basically, I am very bullish for now with NEO. And let me show you the targets. To project targets, I pull Fibonacci extension tool from the bottom of the entire wave to the top of this wave. And third point at the retracement right here, at the lowest point of the retracement. And we have to adjust a little bit this tool because we have uh, these, for now, these two points as our lowest point. And we have uh, slightly new targets. And with the assumption that we have to land the top of our third wave, we have uh, these targets. First of all, the most conservative target at uh, 0.786 level. And for now it is uh, around 81.92 dollars. Second, uh, second uh, potential target is at 1 to 1 extension level and it is 95.88 dollars for now. And uh, the most aggressive target for now is uh, at 1.618 extension level and it is at a price point 138.2 dollars. And from our entry point, let me show it to you, from our current price to our most aggressive target, we have exactly 300%. And don't get me wrong, guys, we won't hit uh, this target in a matter of weeks. We will hit it, 
I think uh, by the end of the year or in the first quarter of 2022. And that's why you have uh, to patiently wait until we hit these targets. And basically from the technical standpoint, that's it for now. If you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with the notification bell. In this case, you won't miss my next video. And uh, see you guys and girls next time. Bye.